In the not too distant future, we will all be wearing biosensing devices that will observe, measure, and record our activities, movements, experiences, vital signs, health, and well being. GPS sensors already know where we are and where we've been. Accelerometers in our mobile devices can tell our gait and infer our mood, whether we're agitated or relaxed, active or resting. Wearable devices track personal metrics like the number of steps we've taken, our heart rate, respiratory rate, skin conductance, blood pressure. Wearable technology promises to transform the way we experience the world, to empower us to better understand ourselves and to encourage positive behavioral shifts. But a missing element up until now are devices that measure and track our cognitive, behavioral, and mental well being. And this is what I have been working on for almost a decade. The human brain is our most vital organ. It supports everyday things we do, including our ability to think, learn, imagine, create, reason, problem solve, plan, and decide. Our brain is an amazing machine that continually rewires and reprograms itself according to how we use it. As we go through life, our brain undergoes extraordinary development. It is the most adaptive organ in our body. It has the capability to change both positively and negatively based on our actions, thoughts, and experiences. Our brain's ability to adapt or neuroplasticity means that we have the power to change and redesign our brain to optimize and take full advantage of our brain's potential. Yet despite this marvel and complexity of the human brain, scientists have little opportunity to watch it at work outside of the lab. For the most part, we only study brains when there is something wrong with them. We have been pushing the boundaries of the latest in science and technology to create portable electroencephalogram systems like these that provide key coverage of useful sites around the cerebral cortex to open new windows on the complex functioning of our brain. Unlike conventional EEG systems, this device requires no specialist knowledge from the wearer. It uses a special hydrophilic polymer sensor, so no scalp preparation is needed. It's wireless, giving the wearer the freedom to move around. And when you compare it with conventional systems, it's around 100 times more affordable. Well, now, let me introduce you to my brain. <laughs> this is my brain in real time. Amazingly, what it's doing right now is it's streaming data from my brain right now as I'm standing here on stage to the computer in the corner, but it can equally stream to any mobile phone or tablet. Being able to understand the brain's plasticity can be used to enhance mental performance in many different ways. For example, many people try to study but find that they are ineffective because they get bored or distracted too easily. One of the key features of effective performance is learning to focus on the task at hand and excluding or minimizing the impact of distractions. Well, firstly, you need to optimize your environment so you can better understand, you know, what are the best times of the day? What sort of lighting conditions? What about background music? even how often you break for coffee, then you need to optimize yourself. Now, this is a little harder because you need someone or something to provide you with information on what you are doing wrong and what you are doing right. Fortunately, it is now possible for us to observe your level of focus 
objectively while you work. You can characterize each learning session or any other activity where you want to improve your performance. Learning the best times of the day, lighting, comfort foods, background music, even break patterns is simply a matter of collecting some statistics on different types of factors. Insight can provide you with objective information around how well you can focus early in the morning compared to late at night. What is the difference between classical music, heavy metal, pop, or complete silence by providing statistical summaries in an easily digestible format. How about learning to relax, avoid stress, reduce anxiety and frustration? All of these things are now possible. We can even monitor the level of attention to critical tasks such as driving a car, this is the kind of thing where allowing yourself to lose your attention and become distracted can be fatal. This same capability can be applied to automate the presentation of teaching materials to optimize the learning rate and reward continued attention and focus. EEG-based applications has also been researched for children with ADHD and it's available with this device. Ultimately, this technology allows us to study brains in conditions and contexts that are diverse as what we experience through everyday life, because the brain wear can be worn while we're undertaking everyday activities. We believe that democratization of brain measurement is crucial if we are to advance understanding of the human brain. By making brain measurement and imaging easier, and yet at increasingly high resolutions, and by providing a platform for more affordable and open participation, there is the opportunity to mobilize the world's population to collaborate on and contribute to large global projects. EEG data can now be collected anywhere in the world, transmitted over mobile phone networks and the internet, and shared with researchers to advance understanding of the brain and to even potentially find early biomarkers for neurological impairments. Up until recently, there has been no concerted effort to accumulate a big data set of EEG recordings from well individuals, which is an essential part of any background study into potential abnormalities. No way to deploy neuroscience experiments or neurological diagnostic tests to remote locations. And no way to analyze massive online data sets of EEG recordings. Did you know that there are 2 billion people worldwide suffering from a brain-related illness? This is the ultimate challenge we hope to address. We are passionate and committed to play our part in reimagining how, where, and why the human brain is observed. We believe the future ahead is bright and that the best way to predict this future is to invent it. Thank you.